Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel today. Um, so we have the heel, <laughs> the heel draft challenge um, in front of us today. And so I am gonna play a little bit of that, but first things first, let's open up this giant chest and see if we can't get something absolutely epic. Oh, Goblin Gang. I've been requesting those a ton lately, so that works out really well. That's, I couldn't have axed, axed. I couldn't have axed for a better card. That was excellent. All right, so let's get right into the draft challenge, and hopefully we can make some drafts happen. I think the key to winning these things, obviously, is in the draft. If you can draft yourself a win condition that is absolutely rocking it, then I think you do pretty dang good. And so we will test that out right now. This is our free entry, and so we're going to take a whack at it with our free entry and see how far we can get. All right, so princess, we'll definitely take the princess um, on the minions. Um, we will take the arrows just so that he can't arrow our princess down because that's horrible. You know what, I'm going to take three musketeers um, just because I think that will be a little bit of a surprise factor. And then I will go ahead and I will take the, Ooh, that's a tough one. I will take the, I'm going to take the knight just so I have a little bit more defense. The dart goblin is pretty good because it chips away at things pretty dang well. And so if you can use that effectively, that's great. So he gave us the mirror, it looks like, some archers and the stinking... <laughs> this stinking Tesla. I hate the Tesla. So we'll drop Princess in the back. We'll get ready for a little push here. Let's go. And then we will go ahead and... Whew, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? We'll wait patiently. I think we'll just drop our knight in the back. The Princess will chip away at that Inferno Tower as long as he doesn't do anything about it. We're going to drop... Oh, dang. Our archers were a little bit too late, unfortunately. But they'll take out the Dark Goblin. So that's not a problem there at all. Um, I think what we're going to do, uh, we don't know what spells he has, so we're going to split our three musketeers in the back just to give it time to get up there. Maybe that infernal tower will die by the time it gets up there. Excellent, excellent. And then we, oh, looks like we have a, we are rolling with a four musketeer deck. So we're going to drop our other musketeer on this side, along with the, um, that should take out, oh, Hilda up, beautiful, well played. Well played. So we'll drop our Tesla down there. Should zap away at that Inferno uh, Dragon or that E Wiz. Holy cow, that was a great play. Did you see that? That was awesome. Good job, him. Um, dang, dude, I did not see that coming. He healed that thing up real nice. Uh, I have not played against the heal spell yet, and so that was the first time that I've actually seen it. So we'll drop Princess again, and then this time we'll get ready for his Dark Goblins. Hope oh, <laughs> Dark Goblin. Because I think that's his route to take her out. Um, do, 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 do. We'll protect her a little bit right here. That worked out perfectly because we saw it coming. Oh yeah, that was perfect play on my part. We're going to split the three musketeers again. And then what I will do, uh, that one musketeer should take out those minions. No problem, look at the split. I'll be a little bit more patient this time on the musketeer plant. Oof. What we're going to do, we're going to drop Knight and Musketeer <laughs> this time. And then another... Yeah, you can't heal it up that fast, buddy. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. So we'll drop Princess. And then we will drop a... Uh, ooh, let's see. What we're going to do. What we're going to do. So we're going to drop... Ooh, uh, oh, oh my gosh, I'm stalling out hardcore, guys. Focus. Just focus for two seconds so you can win this stinking game. We're going to drop three musketeers at the bridge this time just because he does not have his inferno tower in rotation anymore. And then what are we going to do? We're going to drop another three musketeers because I think he gave up. After he lost that one hill spell, he gave up. And so I'm okay with that. Whatever. We'll take a win. We'll take an easy first win right out the bat. So I'm okay with that. I could have dropped three musketeers in the middle there just to end it quicker, but I didn't. I didn't need to. Um, I don't know why you guys... <sighs> Dude, I don't know why he quit, but he was probably mad because he wasn't getting any damage on our towers. The game was kind of going nowhere. But I'm okay with that. Totally okay with that. So that worked out pretty well. Let's get right into our next battle. What, when do we get our first reward? One, two, three, four wins, I think. Something like that. So we get a little bit of gold. <laughs> then we get a giant chest in this one. Um... Dude, I'm going to take the bar pot because it's super annoying. The stinking furnace is super annoying too. Um, I will take the zap, I'll give him the heal, see what happens there. And just because he has fire spirits, I'm going to take the, ugh, I should take the wizard, but I'm going to take the knight. I should have taken the wizard, right? And then we will take, 
Uh, we'll take giant. <laughs> Dude, I don't know. This one's tough. This one's not that great a one. I don't know what I did. I probably screwed up big. Maybe I should have taken Pekka. Always take Pekka, people. <laughs> Always take Pekka. Okay. okay, so he gave us poison arrows, Star Goblin. Boom. All three right in our starting hand. So we will go... Uh, we'll just get... Oh, dang it. We'll drop Prince in the back here. And then we will go ahead... We'll drop... Oh, dang, that was excellent play on his part. Oh, he gave us Battle Ram, too. We're going to go Battle Ram, Prince. Hopefully, we can take out that stinking... Oh, yes. Oh, that is going to do a ton of damage. Tons of damage. Holy cow, dude. That Battle Ram gets up there, dude. It will just go to town. I took out that entire tower. <laughs> I'm okay with that. So now we'll get ready on this side for a little defense action. We will put our Barbarian Hut on that side. He's probably pretty pissed <laughs> right now. <laughs> that was an excellent play. Good job. So he's got his Furnace right there. We're going to put our Giant up there to take out... Nah, what we're going to do... We're going to poison that. Maybe that'll poison those spirits to where they die. Yeah, that worked out perfectly. We'll put a giant right there. That way it'll take out that furnace all the way and then go over to the... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. Let's take out that P.E.K.K.A. <laughs> we gotta take that P.E.K.K.A. out. Take out that P.E.K.K.A. <laughs> Come on, Dark Goblin. Do your job. <laughs> I don't think that Dark Goblin's gonna take out the P.E.K.K.A. <laughs> what do you guys think? Uh, now what do we do for defense since I screwed up again? Uh, we are gonna go Battle Ram for defense. Chase that Battle Ram for a while. There we go. And then we'll drop Prince over here. Hopefully we can take that P.E.K.K.A. down. Oh man, that's not good, guys. Not good at all. P.E.K.K.A.'s gonna get two swings. Two swings. No, three swings. Holy cow, he had zero health and he got flipping three swings off. That was so frustrating. I'm playing horrible now. Gosh dang it. So now what are we gonna do? We gotta drop our Barb Hut again just to annoy the crap out of him, right? And then we gotta drop Giant uh, up here. Um, those two are going to die, so we're going to drop giant, giant up here, and then poison all that. That should take out the, uh, what should we call it? Oh, excellent play on his part. Ooh, I can't, I still can't believe his P.E.K.K.A. got that much damage on us. I'm so mad right now. That should take out that. We'll arrow that away. Get that a little bit down. Oh, dang it! Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. That was good placement by him. That was excellent placement by him. We'll put another giant down, and then we'll put another poison spell down right here. Maybe we'll get something else in there. Poison that, and then we should be able to Dark Goblin his wizard all the way down. That peck is going to do a lot of damage, but not as much as our poison is going to do. And then we should be able to use the... Uh, we'll use Prince on defense here. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Crap, 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 crap. No! No! Oh, that was such a clutch. No! <laughs> Dang it! That was horrible on my part. Dude, I can't believe that P.E.K.K.A. got three swings off with zero health. I was not even worried about him, so that was my fault, dude. Flay up! That is so annoying. Gosh dang. I gotta pay attention. So that's one win, zero losses. We're gonna take the Horde because it's harder to stop. We're gonna take the E-Wiz because I hate the freaking Tesla. Uh, we are going to take, we'll take poison. You know what? We're going to take poison. And then we will take the fire spirits to take out his barbarian horde. Boom. We gave him fire spirits. That would have been horrible. That would have taken out our minion horde. So that was good play on our part. Come on, Sasha. Let's do this this time. I cannot believe that stupid P.E.K.K.A. So flipping annoying. It's not even funny. So what are we going to do? We're going to drop mega minion on the wrong side, of course. And then we will go ahead. We're going to drop our Expo just to keep the pressure all on him. And then we will drop uh, E-Wiz. Take out that, that, and that. Boom, boom. Not a problem. Mega Minion should do go good against that. Not a problem. And then our Expo should take out that. No problem. <laughs> okay. That's awesome. That is awesome. We're going to throw a Goblin Barrel down. And then what we're going to do is... Oh, he can zap it. I forgot he had zap. Dang it. Ha! Ah, think about what you gave him, son. I thought he had nothing. What am I thinking? So now what we're going to do... We're going to come in real hot with our minion horde. And then we are going to go... What are you going to do? We're going to freeze that. Oh, dang! He dropped his freaking musketeer. 
So now he's got a big push coming our way, but that's okay. We're going to drop a... No, I'm not going to do that. We're going to do that and that. Yeah, that was a good heal spell. Boom, 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 boom. Poison's doing more work, though, so that did pretty dang good. Heal spell versus poison right there, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I don't know who won. Probably the poison one. Poison take out a lot of troops, but he healed a lot of troops up, dude. He was he was going to town on that one. All right, so now, what do we got to do? What do we got to do? Okay. We're going to go Goblin Barrel again. Hopefully distract a little bit with that. We're going to go Minion Horde. Boom, boom. Since he can't do nothing there. And then we will freeze all that. He knew our freeze was coming. He knew it. After the first time I used the freeze, but that's okay. Uh, he's got a little bit of a... What do you call that thing? <laughs> Skeleton army. Uh, we're going to do that. And then we should do that. And then we'll poison also. <laughs> poison versus heal again. Here we go. Uh, poison lost that time. The heal actually beat out the poison that time. So that was good. Good job, poison. You did absolutely nothing of your job. We will drop a little bit of a defensive expo. A little bit later than crap. We'll drop that. Uh, we will drop that as well and looks like he's healing up again and we'll drop a poison spell Hopefully that will do something. No nothing. Oh, it'll take out that entire entire army of Skeletons though, and then he's going real hot uh, Real good, so we're gonna go that that and then we will freeze whatever he's got coming our way Boom freeze that freeze that boom boom boom. We should do a quite a bit of damage to the tower there uh, almost all the way. Okay, come on. Keep going. All the way. Now we just gotta... Oh, dang, we're so close. We'll do an expo, and then maybe we can lock on the tower. <laughs> Who knows? Uh, he gave up. Yep, he gave up. <laughs> Already he's too late on his placement. Used all of his licks for defending that minion horde. <laughs> that worked out really well. Okay, so we're two and one. Uh, thanks for dropping by the channel. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to play a little bit more of the challenge. Maybe I can, if I get further along, I'll put out another video collecting some more rewards. Um, and you know what? Hey, uh, t uh, we got some great tutorials coming out, so stay tuned for that. And hey, good luck.